and start packing. The new combined 365 24 hour a day concept of a freestanding emergency department and urgent care in the same facility is a huge market disruptor. And UF Health Jacksonville is leading the way here in Northeast Florida. So we've got Dr. Stephen A. Godwin, professor and chair, of the Department of Emergency Medicine, joining us now with the details. So thanks for joining us. I'm delighted to be here. Thank you. What exactly is unique then about these freestanding emergency departments? What happens with the, a normal freestanding ED is it's just like any emergency department, patients show up and they're charged regardless of their level of injury or level of complaint. And a lot of what we see in emergency departments are often can be treated at an urgent care level. And it, it's much better to, to the consumer if we're able to charge at that level. And due to different regulatory restraints, it's always been very hard to do that. But now we've been able to overcome that, this, overcome that with this new concept that allows us to screen patients for either an emergency department visit or an urgent care visit. And it's all in the same facility, which makes it phenomenal. So Does it that... seems like a lot of benefits then, right? Cost, convenience. Absolutely. Absolutely. And what's great about it is just that you're able to go to one stop, you know that you're being fairly be billed and, and get receiving excellent care. Where will these new sites be located then? Because we, I mean, we have to know where they are, right? To be able to pop into one. Absolutely. And we have three sites we're initially opening. The, the first site is going to be around New, on New Kings Road. It's in near Dunn Village. And then the second site is on Lane Avenue. And that's going to serve wet, the west side. And then the third site is going to be in um, Bay Meadows site, and it's uh, right there at 295. And so the first site, which is the Dunn Village site or the New King site, it is going to open sometime around mid-November, hopefully, with uh, barring any of the, the delays that are currently happening with uh, supply chain issues and so forth. The second site is the Lane Avenue, again, First or second week of December is the, the, the date that we're shooting for. And then the third site is the May, Bay Meadows site that I mentioned, this right there off of uh, 295. And this will be for adults and children, teens, I mean, for everyone? Oh, absolutely. This is uh, all staffed by board certified, board eligible emergency physicians who are able to care for both pediatrics and adults. And again, you're going to get the same excellent care you receive at all the UF facilities. And these are all UF uh, physicians and providers that are taking care of this, UF nursing and uh, taking care of you at these facilities. So we're excited to be able to reach these different areas of town with the UF uh, care and UF presence. Okay, well, before we go, talk about some of the other exciting things that are happening at UF Health. Well, there's a lot of growth currently and a lot of things happening. The Probably the biggest that may have just uh, been in the news is that we got $80 million uh, from the state which, uh, with another matching $10 million that we're not matching, but an additional $10 million that we're throwing in to rebuild the ED and the trauma center. It will be in the name of Dr. Leon Haley, who was our CEO who passed away a little more than a year ago. And we're really excited to be able to, to honor him with this new facility. It, it should be state of the art. We are in the planning phases already, and that's uh, extremely exciting. Uh, in addition to that, we are, we are adding um, space to our ED at the north and also adding a, a additional tower on our north campus that should be there around 2020, early 2024. We're also opening um, late in the, the probably December, January time, an acute ambulatory surgery center that uh, will be right at the end of uh, Kernan and 295 there, the JTB, sorry. So um, that's really exciting to us. And uh, that's just a, a piece of, of uh, some of the things that we're doing. But I wanted to make sure we uh, let you know about that as well. Wonderful. Well, thank you again. And of course, if you'd like to see this segment again, just head to our website, firstcoastliving.net.